Talking about districts, thinking about maybe some of the tougher districts in the state, I think you'd have to think about the one that the Midway Panthers are in, especially you think about number four, Duncanville, DeSoto. Absolutely. And speaking of DeSoto. Yeah, I mean, last week, uh, you know, Midway, they did punch their first win on the season. Fashion. Oh, my gosh, it was exciting. Yeah, that second half comeback. I mean, Shane Anderson's going to do great things there, and uh, that comeback win was 27-18. to 18. And tonight, playing DeSoto and Midway, still trying to get on that win column, but the DeSoto Eagles stroke, were able to strike right away with a touchdown to Murphy to go up 7 to 0. And then later on, Matthew Allen looking to strike once again, and he goes to his main man, Murphy, in the corner of the end zone to make it a 21 to nothing game. But the Midway Panthers, they were not giving up. They were still going at it every inch of the way. And we have Reed Tedford just for a scramble upfield, and he ends up hitting Thornton for. Midway taking this one in for a touchdown and currently in the fourth quarter the score is 62 to 7 with Midway behind.